You're watching 41 Action News. Good morning, I'm 41 Action News anchor Taylor Him. This another violent night in Kansas City. Three people shot within three hours of each other. The first shooting happened just before 11 o'clock on Monday night. Two people were shot at 81st and Campbell. Both set to recover, we're told, with no suspect information just yet. The other shooting happened just before 1 o'clock this morning. A man shot at 33rd and Garfield. He's also expected to recover, and there's no suspect information in this case either. Police identified 25 year old Raven Parks as the woman killed Sunday night in a shooting at a Kansas City nightclub. Parks was at nine ultra lounge celebrating the Chiefs win. Family tells us she was in the middle of walking out the door with her friend when they walked into the gunfire. 15 other people were injured in that shooting. We know at least one person is still in critical condition today. Mayor Quinton Lucas said today to meet with the city regulated office to look at the club and decide if it's a nuisance moving forward. Here's your forecast with Lindsay Anderson. Temperatures this morning off to a really cold start. We're down in the single digits, but warm up nicely for the afternoon, or at least better than yesterday. Low 30s expected this afternoon. Our breezes will begin to pick up just as clouds are moving in. So with the stronger winds later on today, it is going to feel more like the low 20s. Cloud cover first, then comes the precipitation. That's all tomorrow morning. We'll get snow, maybe some sleet and rain mixed in by the afternoon tomorrow. Cutting the cable cord? 41 Action News is now on Roku. Search KSHB, add our channel, and you're set. All of our newscasts stream live. No other station in Kansas City can say that. Get clear, complete coverage on 41 Action News now on Roku.